I'm Kara Crafton. I'm with the Number Four Pro Team, and I am backstage at the JC Abondo Spring Summer Show. Um, we just finished the looks for the runway, and I'm going to show you how we got them. First of all, we started with prepping with styling foam. We added that to dry hair to create texture, and with my fingers, I blow dried just to create some softness and movement at the root. This is basically like a disheveled knot, something really simple that any woman can wear. Um, JC is really big on setting the trends, and considering that he's involved with a hair care company, he wanted to make sure that whatever she showed on the runway was something that women would translate to and he would be a trendsetter for spring. Um, we're gonna start after we get the movement we want with the styling foam to play with pushing it back. Um, I'm gonna start with a couple of bobby pins to create a little bit of softness. I wanna make sure that I don't take it too tight. Um, the bobby pins we actually used for the show, we took black bobby pins and right before the models came, we used sandpaper to take out all the shine and to give them a distressed look so that we would have a little more of an unfinished kind of effect on the bobby pins because the style is also very kind of raw and easy. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and start pulling the hair up at the crown to create a pony. I wanna make sure that I don't get it too tight and there's still a lot of softness and sort of a windswept look. All right, as I go to secure, I'm gonna just use a black elastic I pull the hair through once, the hair comes through a second time, and on the third pass, I'm going to twist the ends as I pull through to kind of create that disheveled knot. The whole idea is that it isn't perfect and that it has a very easygoing look to it. At this point, I'm just going to take some pins and play with placing it. Um, part of the, the ease of this is that the, you don't mind if the bobby pins show and the elastic. Let it just look very carefree. I play with the ends to kind of create a little bit of texture. And at this point, I'm going to grab some of the Mighty Hairspray and just work with a little bit on my fingertips to pull out some loose bits and make it softer. I can also use this spray to set the style. And you just kind of play with it until it feels the way you want it to look. Turn your head a little bit. And there you have it. That is the look from our J.C. Abondo show here at the number four protein.